Good morning, afternoon, and evening, everyone. This is Hippie Tesla. Welcome to episode 11 of Chrono Cross. Let's not forget this. It's already 11? Yep, already episode 11. <laughs> already, even with all the breaks. 2742, it's always, what's what was the last save? This one. Back from the darkness and on with a new journey. So, last time we had an accident. And now Surge is Lynx. And we got Harlan, uh, what's her face, Sprig in the party as well. I think we have all the other characters now, do we? No, I don't know, actually, no. They don't even know I exist now. For them, I'm dead, right? And we're in the wrong dimension too. We're in the... Wait, if you're in the original one, then you're in the other Well, yeah, we went to Fort Dragonia in another world when that happened. Wow! <laughs> hey man, what's up? How's work? I know you should be there for the... For a few hours now. Imagining you're still out there. So yeah, we came from another world. And when Link swapped uh, swapped our bodies and like he basically sent me to the <laughs> No, I'm happy to see you man. <laughs> In the positive sense, yeah. Oh really, sorry to hear that. You don't enjoy what you do or just generally sucks because it's early? Yeah, what was the last Sprig said? She wanted to see the dimensional gate, that's right. Where is it though? What the hell? Where's my the gate? I'll just try to use the necklace. That's all I know. Nope. What's wrong, Lynx? Don't tell me the dimensional gate won't open. Eh, you be in hot water now. Of course it won't open. The missing pieces to this, to this world has been found. There is nothing we can do. You are now just an unwanted piece. Very interesting. What are you gonna do now, Lynx? How about we go explain your situation to your mother? <laughs> of all the solutions, sure. We may be able to find something out. It's Monday and you're tired. Oh, it's one of those days, yeah. Well, you just power through it, man, and rest tonight. <laughs> I know it, how it feels. <laughs> Alright, so go see mom, I guess. Yeah, looking like this, it's gonna be sun. I mean, I know youth and drugs and all that, but geez, son, what did you do? Oh yeah, they don't like demi humans here. That's right. Wow. Can't remember what time it was when I saw you in the stream, but uh Oh yeah, we checked this. But that's the longest shift. Where where's my house? Which which one? Let, let's talk to people. Wow, awesome! You're for real, right? Are you a human cat or a cat human? Do you like catnip? Well, do you like catnip? Uh, <laughs> of course. I thought so. I guess you are what you eat. Grandma also told me that how you look on the outside is a reflection of what's in your heart. Grandma's a smart woman. Huh? Who, 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 do, who are you? What do you want? 
Oh, I know, you're after my sawfish, aren't you? Am I right? Well, I got no fishes for a stray cat like you. Now, scram! Shoo, shoo! <laughs> it's been quite a while since I encountered a demi-human in this village. I hear you only find demi-humans in Galdov and aboard the Zelbas these days. These days. Well, hello there, huh? Who are you folks? Demi humans, eh? Just don't just don't cause any trouble in our village, okay? Okay, Granny. What what who or what are you? What do you want? Oh it's Una. What? No way! You're Sergi? You Give me a break! Our Sergi is human! Read my lips! Human! He's not a demi-human like you! You're full of it! Full of poop? Well, what shall you do, Monsieur Lynx? Nobody in your village believes that you are Serge. Of course we don't believe you! Hey, Kukuji! Hello, welcome to the stream, good to see you! How are you doing over there? Everyone in this village knows Sergi. We're not gonna be fooled by a bunch of demi-humans like you. I don't know what you jokers are up to, but just get the hell out of our village. Jeez, kid. <laughs> wow. They really raise him a certain way here. Wow, you sure are strange looking. Are you a cat man? You're not gonna bite my head off or scratch me to death, are you? <laughs> uh, this is the well remake, the re re. It's not a remake. It's more like of a of a port, just a port. Redoing. Yeah, redoing. <laughs> it's, it's a port. I'm not even playing with the upgraded visuals because they make the game run. Yeah, remaster. I guess. Yeah, that would be the word. Not even the like the original visuals and everything, because the, the frame rates are worse than they were on the PS1 already. And with upgraded visuals, they're even worse. Plus, I don't like the upgraded visuals, really. <laughs> but I'm not afraid of you. I'm big and strong. Besides, my surge will protect me. I am your surge, kid. Hmm, I see. Surge, would you that for you? If that is the case, then you are safe. No one will be able to hurt you. Hurt you. I know. Ah, so there. Yeah, it is. But, you know, it's... See, this is what I'm talking about. It it should be, you know, smooth 60. All around, but it's not. <laughs> it just depends on how many, how many characters are on screen, really very noticeable in battles. If you're like fighting one enemy, it's super smooth. There's just like five of them, sometimes there's like ten enemies on screen, Jesus Christ, becomes a slideshow. <laughs> Hi, mommy. Who might you be? May I help you? What? What did you just say? Your Surge. Well, that's not mom's voice, but still. Please explain to me exactly what is going on here. And Serge tells her. I see. Yeah, I think we gave her more like normal voice. <laughs> she doesn't have to be so exaggerated. <laughs> so that man told you to go to the Sea of Eden. I really don't know about dimensional distortions or about the other world. But, but if, like you say, something big is really on the verge of happening, it may have all started 14 years ago, on the night of the storm. Oh, she's gonna tell him a piece of that story. That night your father, Wazuki, because you don't remember his name, obviously, and his friend Miguel, who also you don't remember, set out to sea despite the storm. It was an emergency. They were swallowed by the waves and lost consciousness. When they came to, they found themselves in the Dead Sea. A place no living creature dares enter. I don't know what he saw or what happened, but that incident changed your fa father. And your father's friend, Miguel, 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 he was Lena's father, and he never returned. 
Back then, that place wasn't called the Dead Sea. Yes, I believe they called it the Sea of Eden. That was 14 years ago. Smigwell. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Are you the ones everybody's talking about? Oh, no, wait, that's someone else. Are you the one, Sharon? Oh, that's Master Roshi. Ra ra radius, I mean, radius. Master Radius. No, this can't be. Are you Lynx? You're still alive? Step outside, Lynx. For I, too, was once a valiant member of the Acacia Dragoons. I must put a stop to you. La, la, la. Giza, I wouldn't show off like that. That, that is, if you want to live. <laughs> Do not underestimate the power of Monsieur Lynx. One blow and it's off to the other world with you. Silence! Now step outside! Oh, don't even give me the opportunity to step outside. Just slap me in the face. <laughs> oh, we're outside, I guess. He's got powers of teleportation. On guard! Oh, so he's green, alright. Damn, Gramsa didn't even get to do anything. So we need yellow, which thankfully we do have. Who? Uh. Carl? God damn it. Okay, do we have enough? No. I need to morph her, but she needs... I think one more level. Oh, I thought he turned me into stone. That looked like that. So yellow. Electro bolt plus one. High res. You know what? Yo. Oh, she does want to. Really. <laughs> Damn, I need something yellow. Uplift. One uplift for you. Not even gonna do anything scary. Oh, he's got Photon Beam now. He's got the white elements. Okay, Sprig. I need that transformation. Well, it's not gonna... Damn it, Sprig. I'm gonna be a cat burger. Make a cat team. <laughs> Just because I like you, Radius, I'm gonna defend for now. Hmm. Defend. Defend. Damn, if I knew, I would have laid an Inferno Trap. You know what? Next, I'm just gonna start starting battles with, with it active. Right away. Cover all, sure. There, yeah, I get to at least hit him with a cat. What can you do, kitty? 
Ma magma bomb strength and triple fist. Double gang to go back. 99. Keeps hit potential. Oh, basically. Oh, it's not, not really interesting skills here. Triple fist. I stand defeated! Of course you do. <laughs> yeah, it is like Kamehameha. <laughs> We're good. And back inside. Mm, I do not sense any malice in your attacks. Except the ones that I just wanted to take your soul. Nothing else. <laughs> What if I used, like, Hell Soul or something like that? Would he say that? Do you really mean to tell me that you are not Lynx? And is it true that the General is still active in the other world? Here, the General has been missing for the past three years now. Understood. I shall accompany you. I didn't invite you, but sure. We may still have a chance to save the General and Riddle in the other world. Zut? What, what is Zut? This geezer is only going to get in the way. Radius, join your party. He's also green like Sprig, huh? But I do want to keep using sprig for now less magic will put more strength more accuracy less agility and more magic resistance okay it's good to have him there i'll keep the party as it is for now we must gather news in terminal about general viper's disappearance we may find clues to show us how to return to the other world I, Radius, shall give it my all in the name of General Viper. Sorry you had to witness that, Ma. There, there are people out there who won't judge you by your appearance. Just keep your heads up. Head up. <laughs> you only have one head. <laughs> and do your best. Understand, Serge? Yes, I do. I still speak our language, Mother. my room nothing's really changed maybe I should have taken radius no radius 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 I'm gonna say radius should be a record of fate here if not I can just go outside right? nope they're not gonna let me use it Keep Harl, but I'm gonna swap out. Who do I want to swap out? Hmm. What was it? Teleporter. Instead of her, I guess. For now, at least. Oh, right, there's so much to do with that. Sheesh. Well, I, don't, I know you need him for one bit, but we'll see. Then I gotta remove everything from. Brig was it? He's got his iron mail, which is good. There. Try 
Charm, 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 defense, charm, HP, stamina, evasion maybe, huh? Well, he's no better than the rest, so no, something else. He uses his stuff as well, that's something to keep an eye. Dancing shoes, right? That's what I picked? Where are they now? Who gives a shit? Silver loop, side scope, magic maybe? Damn, evasion and magic, there you go. I don't know, radius. I really don't know what to do with you, man. I first gotta see how it plays. Oh, interesting element grid, look at that. It's got a lot of lower level elements. Well, let's fill them up. Sure. Tablet, yeah. Turn, turn, turn. Or... Gravity blow, photon ray, uplift. Well, we'll bushwhacker. We'll get one of each color. Attack and support. Aqua beam. Yep, perfect. Really interesting grid. Actually, it should start from the bottom. Why not? Now level 2, Ice Lance, Magma Bomb, what else, Aero Saucer, Electro Jolt, Hell Soul, cool, he really covers everything, I have a feeling he'll be pretty good in battle. If we need that against someone. Heal. Now it gets a little simpler. Capsule, sure. Graviton and... Photon beam. On this corner, Ice Blast, Magma Burst, Electro Jolt. With fives, now we get, gets trickier. What was it? Magnify at six, yeah. We'll put Magnify there. And then two things, like low res and high res can both go here, or eagle eye, bat eye. What to say, low res. And bat eye, there you go. Sheesh. Better save this. <laughs> Don't want to redo it. Alright. I don't think there's anything else in the village. I'm just gonna check. Quickly. Will I even find Lena? Oh, there she is. Ah, oh, who are you? What, Serge? No, that's a lie. What, what the heck is going on? Yes, it's me, Lena. I'm sorry, but I don't believe you. How am I supposed to believe you're Serge when you look like that? I'm sorry. Well, weren't you with me? This is the same Lena, right? We, we went with Lena from... Oh no, we went with Lena from another world. That's right. That's right. Okay.
Fossil Valley. It was closed for us in, in Homeworld at the start of the game. Now it should be open. Yo, check out that guy's face. Way scary. Our investigation is done. Let's get the hell out of here. I want to go back to poor. Well, thanks for telling us where you're from. There's a dingo. Dingo dial. What do we get from you? Hey, Radius was a boss. We got a growth level off the Radius. I totally forgot that. Mama dingo. Do you want to not kill it? Feral cats, there you go. Kill a dog with a bunch of cats. Yes, kitty. Body. Bravo. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's still alive. Old man radius slapped it to death. Slappity slap. I can hear the bird, but again, we did that in another world, not here. Oh yeah, I saw something I want to fix. There's the crazy bird. Hold on, kitty. Let me just check something. Yeah, there it is. Hippotron. Alright, we'll see when next time Capitron comes around. The announcement, because slash me doesn't work in an, in an announcement. There you go. Oh look, there's a chest. That's where Skelly was. Infrared vision frame. Do we fight them? Yep. I had to touch them. <laughs> I had to touch them to check. With the big bird too. Dodo. Drongo. Those are Drongos. That kid kept mentioning in Radical Dreamers. Now we're gonna do Feral Cats again. Because I can't steal. It really doesn't matter what I do. I just need them eliminated as soon as fast as possible. Single, single, single. Okay, just feral text is all. Feral text? Feral cats. Those are supposed to be scratches, I think. Squawk! I think it's pissed off. Okay, Radius. Is that like... It look, looks like... Diglett. I don't know. I don't know what to think of it. I think your sword faster than the eye can see. What's the first one? That's the one he used on us, right? Hit full from afar with Chi Aura. Okay, let's use a quick draw. Though the bird is um, white in eight, just seventy six. Squawk! Peck. Oh boy, this is gonna hurt, huh? Could have been worse. Could have been worse. 
You want to attack a drone go? Because I need my... Well, actually I don't. With my accuracy high. Let's try the moons. We didn't try moonshine. All allies... Wait, all allies? Really? Use lunar energy to protect your party. Oh, cool. Hellbound. No, no. Moon beams. All enemies. Use lunar energy to create blades of light. Yes. Oh yeah, we did this. Blades of light. Literally sickles of light. Okay, don't touch those, please. Again. <laughs> There's a chest behind that one, though. So do touch that one. Again, the same thing, huh? Shit. Okay, they both missed. Of all the things, they expected a peck or something. Squawk! <laughs> Let's try this. Moonshine. Defense and magic defense. Nice. Do you have any black elements? Graviton, all enemies, yes. We'll make an all black field. And now Lynx should finish them off. There's no one else <laughs> no one left to finish. Hold the eyes. All that for a piece of mithril. Well, I guess it's a rare material. Oh, there's the bird. More mithril. Oh shit. Okay, I avoided it in another world, but here I messed up. Oh, just a normal do dodo. Okay. <laughs> Message! Oh, a trap. They use the trap on me. Element trap. Oh, enemy has laid a trap. I don't have a trap set up, so I'm just gonna whack him from now on. I don't know what to. He might. Uh, he can't eat this, so. Or this. So I'm gonna use those first. Text cannot be eaten, as far as I know. Oh, 
Let's try. Ugh. It worked. Fuck your trap. <laughs> send him to hell. Literally send him to hell. Not even a metaphor this time. Damn, I feel bad now about that bird. Oh, there it is. It's back from hell, I guess. So it's not... <laughs> no, dingo, you'll die. It's not even, like, forever. It's just until you come back. One screen over. Who's that? Lynx! How dare you have the nerve to return to this town! Get out of here! Who's that? Looks like the young guns are an unwanted guest here, too. Two? Humans are very selfish, no? To think that they used to bow their heads down to curry favor with Monsieur Lynx. They're always searching for someone or something to lay their blame on. I'm on patrol duty, don't bother me. Ah, uh, you said duty, man. Anything up here? No? Well, what's the point of this? Oh. Don't move. I'll wait for you. <laughs> So this is the other Termina. Well, Termina in the home world. We haven't seen this one yet. We have closed our business operations. Visitors are welcome to stay for free. Oh, jeez. There's a major difference in this world's Termina. It's been invaded by the poor military. Nothing here but the room. And another room. That's it. No, that's not what I wanted, but okay. Bar and shop. Let's try here. Can it be you, Sir Lynx? You are safe, sir. Where have you been all this time? We have set up a temporary military dock beyond this point. Nobody may pass without the permission without permission from Commander Norris. Not even you, Sir Lynx. Commander Norris is at the ruins of Viper Manor. Please report your current status to him immediately. Oh, okay. The music's still the Fossil Valley theme. Even though I'm here relaxing, I can't shake this mystery from my mind. Will you listen to my story? Sure. It happened about three years ago. General Viper and his men disappeared from the manor. We searched the manor for them but found no traces. I can only guess that they were spirited away. What in the world could have happened? To think that the same thing might happen to me someday. I just can't help being afraid even when I'm trying not to think about it. Okay. So that's what happened. They just disappeared? That's what he said, right? Right? Yep, just disappeared. That guy Norris sure is cocky. He's still young, but he doesn't hesitate to voice his opinion. 
He never loosens up and doesn't seem interested in having any kind of fun. But he's the best of the Terminal Division. Gosh, he's so elite, hmm? That dragon's glory really is something special. It's just like they say, you can taste it with your whole body. And the dry lizard stuff is great too. <laughs> of course, you can't forget the local specialty, squid gut pasta, either. Ooh, I'm gonna get a bunch of weight on for sure. You don't look like it, man. It's been quite some time since I've been around here. I did, I'm just in peace. <clears throat> <laughs> Teleporter. It's nice and peaceful compared to the mainland. It's not like I had anything fun to do back home. Maybe I should just stay here forever. You, weren't you the guy at Sir Viper's Manor? Get yourself out of here. Our beautiful terminus been turned into a mess because of you. We don't serve your kind here. So Lynx did something in this world three years ago. Obviously he was... he had a hand in what happened with the disappearance of General Viper in this dimension. What the hell is that? Oh, jeez, I thought it's a faceless creature. Welcome. We're low on stock right now, but please look around. Oh, does she recognize me? Because she was awfully familiar with my situation in the other world. Ten more, fuck it. have 30 of each so I don't have to think about that was a blackout 27 what's the money money still good cure plus you say huh I'll take one of those I have one of those Okay, everything else I have. You really don't recognize me? Is this her room? Yep, apparently. Are you looking for my father? I'm very sorry, but... He's out in the forest gathering mushrooms. Sounded like she was gonna say he died. I even told him that we are doing inventory tomorrow. Ah, I wonder when he'll be coming back. That mushroom hobby of his drives me crazy. One day he's going to turn into a mushroom himself. Oh, that went in nowhere. Off she goes grumbling. I guess nothing else here. There's two shops now. Let's check. Oh wait, there's someone up here. Can I climb? Yeah. Compared to the mainland, there's nothing special around here, but the view cannot be matched. I'm thinking of moving over here permanently to enjoy the country life. Oh, so you come from poor, I guess? You guys all just decided to live here. Who's this? Wait, who's this first? This guard guy. This is the poor army state of the art of weaponry. As long as we have this, the citizens of Termina wouldn't dare revolt against us. I 
I can't see what that is with that stalking. <laughs> Arg! Arg! It's such a pity. The statue of Master Viper that I've polished every day has changed to this. The once. Oh, that's the old man. The once magnificent manor is also long gone. If only Master Viper were here, none of this would have happened. <sighs> he, 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 if it isn't Sir Lynx, he, it's all a great. No, it's a great relief that you're safe. Oh, really? What's the statue? It's like. A griffin? Sir Lynx, you're still alive? There's nothing here in this old shack, but would you like some tea or something? Get out, you big stray cat! <laughs> I don't like you! Now there, stop that! Father's the one who is always saying it! If this guy never came here, we wouldn't be in this mess! Oh, really? Uh, no, Sir Lynx. Um, well, you see, it's just kids talk. There's this stray cat that steals our fish around here, so... Oh, <laughs> it's really a nuisance. Come on now, you apologize too. <laughs> We're really sorry. You don't seem like it. He is sorry. She's not sorry. But that's not why I'm here for. I don't. I don't look for apologies. Oh, look at that! They really have a bunch of fish. Who is that walking past to the window every few seconds? Did you see that? There he is. He's coming back. Huh? I can't. Can I go behind? Actually, I think I can go behind the house. Nope. I wonder what's the deal with that. It's not like I can talk to him. Nope. Oh, looky here. Just weapons. Okay. What about Kelly's house? There's Kelly's grandma. And Kelly's mom, I guess? Grandma's been worried sick ever since the poor army took her grandson away. She loved him so much. I just hope he's alright. Oh, is he dead in this world too? Oh, my poor Kelly. I pray that you are safe. Yeah, I can't even show her Skelly here. Again, like... Probably hindsight now, but... Uh, shouldn't call your child Skelly. It's kind of painting its future. And all. We will open fire on any suspicious ship if it does not respond to our call. When you travel by ship, I advise you to be careful. Inform me immediately if you find anything. Like rocks? Planks? <laughs> yeah, his name is Kelly. That, that is the issue. Who names their child Kelly? What brings you here? You shouldn't come around here on a whim. The spirits here will wake if you disturb them. Living beings are too radiant for the spirits. Just last night a man's spirit appeared at my bedside. He said his name was Getz or something. He's probably another lost soul still attached to this world. Very common around here. In any case, it's nothing concerning you. Now run along and go home. Oh god. Okay, what about Greco's not here, right? Granny no feeds. 
<laughs> yeah. Pa šta ako si skeleton? Nisi narkoman, šta onda? <laughs> There's another guard here. Guard, guard, guard. Beneath the sacred sword, the warriors lie. Thirteen Tagesh. Thirteen Takesha Dragoon, Grandmaster Garai. Fourteen Takesha Dragoon, Grandmaster Dario. Garai, forgive me. Okay, so that's it's got something to do with him. It's a weird way to get there. Come here, sir. I may have a question for you. I checked the sword in the ground over there, but it turned out to be rusty. It's probably called a sacred sword in honor of a lost family member. Oh, so it's not real? It shouldn't be rusty. Okay, let's go all the way up. really hurts the eyes when it starts jerking like that <clears throat> me, 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 me. <laughs> there's too many kids here huh? come on I want to get out jeez inform me if anything happens like things are happening constantly dude you want me to inform you 24 7 things are happening now and now and now Oh, that Paul, he's working hard to join the Black Wind of Poor, but I wonder if he'll ever tell me, I'll be your wind. Ah. Oh, that, this kid wants to be in the Black Wind of Poor? Kid, stop that. Stop, he may have a chance. I have a hard time catching him. <sighs> the key to gunfights is balance. It's not just a matter of shooting. That's what Mr. Norris said, so I'm running around training myself to stay on my toes. Phew! Mr. Norris must have gotten strong the same way. We'll see, kid. We'll see. Oh, what about this kid? Me? I love boats, but I can't become a sailor because I get seasick. That's why I decided to become a ship craftsman and build the fastest and awesomest boat ever made. So my first step is to watch all the boats here for research, research, and research. Ain't I smart? Out of all the boats I've seen, that boat at the docks is the best and fastest of them all. I wish I could build one like that. Oh, really? Uh, I'm having a difficult time today. Well, and yesterday too. <laughs> Going, like, doing higher pitches. But I'm trying. I, that should do it. Oh, he's hurt in this world. Look at his eye. This year, Forge has always had a fire since olden times. Tis sad, I can't do a Scottish accent for the life of me. Tis sad to see it without its blaze. My apologies, closing this shop for my own selfish desires. <laughs> Zappa's wife, Zippa. Zappa and Zippa. I've had to listen to you for the longest time and I did not <laughs> want to hear you say it's foolish now. Never mind that, dear. So you're really going. I. <laughs> no, I think he wasn't in the in the... In another world. I think he, his face was whole, but I may be wrong. Now that I do not have the shop no more, like say, it's time to finish what we started long ago. You stay here and wait for Karsh's return. Oh, Karsh is missing. It's already been three years. This, oh, I pressed the button. 
years something something. Our best patrons, the Dragoons, disappeared. The poor military gets on our asses. Well, since we had such bad luck, I'm sure things will be good for me here on out. Our son's probably fine as well. <laughs> I. I, woman. Okay. You're all travelers, aren't ye? Have you seen our son anywhere? His name is Kosh. He's a pretty rough character, but he's a good boy. It's tough having a son who's a knight. You never know when he might just come back as a ghost in armor. I wonder what could have happened at the Dead Sea. If I could see my son again, I wouldn't ask him for anything else. Oh, I'm sorry to make you feel blue. Well, if you ever find him, just tell him to come back for a little while. That's a sad Scottish mom. Blah. Okay, move, Harla. Radius, it's been a while. How fares the village? You need not worry about the village. There are bigger things to concern us. I'm guessing you know from around here. Do you can a thing called rainbow? It's a superb material that can be forged into anything. I'm thinking of searching for some. You wouldn't have mind if I joined you, eh? Let, let him join, of course. Aye, great. Then I'll give you a wheat token. Use this anytime and I'll find you and do my job anywhere ye happen to be. I give my word. Oh, we got the Smith Spirit. All right, we, we want that. And we got Zappa to join our party. What's his innate? Red. Sorry, Harl. I want to see how it does. Which means more equipping. Yay! Oh, that's all. Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy. No. <laughs> да. Стварно. Што ти прво падне на пове трябва. All right. I'm gonna. Should I give him? Let's see his stats first. I believe he's a physical ca character, but. I gotta find Harl again, unequip all everything, then equip it on him. Hmm. So you wanna boost his defense or attack? Copper helmet is better. I can't believe it. <laughs> what else? He's got terrible accuracy. Well, let's make him all physical. Dragoon Gauntlet. There you go. 43 attack. She. <laughs> Elements. Allocate Zappa. Now let's give him something 
Mio. Kio, why not? I do want some antidotes though. Just in case. Fireball and uplift, sure. Level two, something sure. Don't die, kitty, please. Level five, you're so clumsy for a cat. Five 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 four Fuck it, just use that and that. Yeah. And he's got two level sixes. Why dude? Why not? Ice blast and Low res, high res. Oh, let's say that. I don't know. It takes a long time after you, whenever you change a character. If you just don't want to blindly put it on. I can't bear watching him. Master Zappa just hasn't been himself since his son Karsh disappeared. He doesn't concentrate on his work and often stares out the window. Gosh, he's not some kind of love-struck youth or something. He's just not behaving normally. I'm sorry about what I've done to you, laddie. I couldn't have finished teaching you basics of smithing. But with your passion, you're sure to be a success at any job. Work hard as a trader and make me proud. Master. Don't expect me to be satisfied <laughs> with such words. <laughs> I'm not gonna become a blacksmith here, so I'm gonna switch over to being a trader. Need anything? Oh yeah, I'll trade. Oh cool. So we, we need something. We can always trade here. All right. Swing on by when you need something. Yep. There's no mirror where uh, <clears throat> Pierre was fixing his hat. <laughs> Nothing there. What about their house, the brother's house? <laughs> Scottish, we had a stroke. <laughs> I hear this night Glenn is an extremely hot-tempered and hard-headed guy. My, my, that's why prehistoric soldiers like knights are such a nuisance. So Glenn's still alive? From what I've heard, this shack is where Dario and his brother Glenn lived. Some people claim to have seen him, so we're currently looking for this Dario, but just when we tell them the Acacia Dragoons were gone, this troublemaker decides to come back. If you find any information about him, let us know. Hi Wesky, thanks for the raid man. Welcome raiders, welcome. Hi Simon, hello, hello guys. 
How were the games, Wesky? Let's see if the new shout-out works. Ah. Ha. Huh. There we go. Check out Professor Wesker, everyone. Oh, you were playing Code Veronica? When did you switch games? Nice. Still the knife run? How far are you? Did you get to Chris part? Sweet. Oh, you finished the nice play. Damn, man. Today? Or did you play the bonus games? Oh, I need water. Awesome. This Dario person seems to have been an exceptionally dignified man. If he's still alive, we should enlist him into the Black Wind. He's not alive in this dimension, is he? Well, he's not alive in either. Yeah, I admire you just doing that, what you did there. <laughs> With the knife and all. It's going well. I'm assembling more party members. Growing my ever-growing group of friends. Well, he's, he's a painter here. He's not a businessman. Phew! Van's father, go. Uh-huh. So he is a painter. Are you Van's friends? He's over in the back room. So he's a painter in this dimension. That's the life he didn't choose in another world. Wait, their house is small, right? Wait, it's not a mansion. Where's the back room? Look, it's not a... It doesn't have a bell. I didn't even notice. There's the back room. <gasps> At least knock before you enter. Oh, that's Van. Are you guys tourists? If you want, I'd be willing to guide you around. Of course, there's a small fee involved. I think it's a bargain. How about it? Hire him. You got it. Th that, that is... That is what? Huh? You've had long enough... Oh, wait. Is that... Is that a lady in a sweater? I can't tell. <laughs> You've had long enough to pay your debts, and I'm not going to wait any longer. Either you pay up now, or I'll have to move, or I'll have you move out of this house. Oh, that's their landlady. But what will happen to my son and me? That's none of my concern. I just want to make this place into my personal storage for my precious treasures. Hey, wait, I'll pay the debt. Or will you now? Well, this is amusing. How is our little Mr. Van today? How much have you saved from your allowance? Yeah, yeah, very funny. This is what I got. Ha ha ha, this won't even pay you off the interest. Better luck next time. Just wait a little bit more. Then I'll be able to get the money you need. What are you planning to do, little Vaughn? Don't waste your energy on something stupid. I'm going with these guys to search for the frozen flame. Who mentioned the frozen flame? You just... Where did you get that? Did we tell him the story already? So please, wait just a little longer. No, it's his son. <laughs> he said my son. Oh, just listen to you. You're pretty bright, but you're still just a kid. It's so naive of you to believe in a fairy tale like the frozen flame. Of course, it's a joke, isn't it? It's a joke, of course. Nope, we're serious. Look, he's with a fucking cat person there, and you are you don't believe in a frozen flame? Amazing. You actually believe that legend. 
Are you people crazy or something? Ha ha ha, not a bad joke, though. The frozen flame is supposed to be the treasure of all treasures. Even if it's just a legend, there's something very tempting about it. All right, I will wait a little longer. Have the frozen flame ready by the time I come back here. Be careful not to burn yourself. Although you'll probably never find it. <laughs> oh, what a horrible lady. How arrogant of her to push us around just because we're poor. If only we had money. If we did, this never would have happened. Hey, hey, Van, none of that. So, like, in another world, they were rich because his father didn't follow his dream to be a painter and instead became a businessman, accountant, I think. And they're, they're really loaded to have this mansion, but uh, Van was still not happy there because his father was never home. So it's an interesting take on, you know, personal happiness. Besides, even though we don't have money... I don't want to hear that from you, Dad. Where are we going to live as of tomorrow? We're out of money because we're not selling any of the paintings we have in this room. I'm sorry, Vaughn. These pictures are just not good enough to sell yet. I only want to sell pieces that I'm satisfied with. To those who understand my work. Fine. Then I'm going to have to be the one to find us a place to live. Do you enjoy watching family disputes? There's absolutely positively nothing here for you. So there's no point in hanging around. Thanks. Thank you for going along with my bogus story. Wait, what? Hmm, I think it's a pretty good picture. So why won't it sell? Dad isn't too active about selling his work. He says cocky things like he'll only sell it to those who understand it. Oh well. I guess I'll have to come up with the money myself. Oh, look at that. He's got... A hole in the wall. Okay, let's see. My piggy bank is... Yep, it's here. Okay, the money's in here, too. Now the hardest part is finding a place to live. Next we have... Dad's homemade paint color, El Nido Blue. Painting the sea in this color gives it the smell of salt water, supposedly. If I were dad, I would have sold this paint by itself and made a fortune off it. Damn, kids got like three saves in the wall? This seashell. Is that a rainbow seashell kid? No, it's not. Mom, the only remaining reminder between me and mom is this shell. It's cracked can't even hear the sound of the sea. But I... I remember it all. Mom found the shell and held it gently to my ear. And I remember that sound, the sound of the sea. I was also... I, no, I also got mad because I couldn't take home the sandcastle I made that day. And now we have to move out of the house Mom and I lived in. But don't worry, Mom. I'll take good care of that for you. Van always had a hard time dealing with our troubles. Ever since he was a child, I made him do without so many things that he's grown a bit sarcastic. Yet he's very kind at heart, like his mother always was. One day, I hope, I can let him do as he pleases, just like other children. You guys are still here? You need something? Or are you here to buy my dad's paintings? Actually, what you, <laughs> what you were just saying. We really are looking for the frozen flame. Huh? If you're being sarcastic, you got me pretty ticked. Oh, I get it. Are you trying to cheer me up or something? I don't under, don't underestimate me because I'm a kid. I know that no such thing exists in this world. 
Or are you all some kind of simpletons? Whatever you believe it, no, whether you believe it or not is up to you. Stop looking at me like that. You remind me of my mom. Your eyes tell that you're telling the truth. Even I can see that. But I can't do it. I just can't leave my dad here and go off on some fool's errand. Although it's tempting. I'll be alright, man. I'll be alright, son. You just go... P fight <laughs> monsters in the swamp and whatnot. <laughs> I'll be okay here. You don't have to find any frozen flame or anything. I just want you to go out into the world and broaden your horizons. Of all the people in the world, only a handful live in happiness. No, maybe not... Maybe even those who look happy aren't really happy at all. I want you to go find out for yourself what real happiness means. So, go. Just go. <laughs> Dad. Van. Just be careful to lock up at night. <laughs> it'd, be a, it'd be bad if any of the paintings were stolen. I will. Be careful out there. Oh, yes. Wait, just a moment. Take this with you. This is a boomerang? Dad, I'm not going out there to play. What am I going to do with this? This isn't a toy. During your journey, there will be danger. This should help you when that time comes. And a boomerang comes back when it's thrown. I want it to be a reminder to you. So it's a good luck charm, huh? Hmm, I don't care for such things, but... Oh well, I'll just take it with me, just in case. Alright, we gotta go before she comes back again. Van joined your party. And now we can change his name. He's green as well. We've got three green members right now. He's focused on magic, I can see. Lynx and him have the highest magic. Okay. Pretty good. I will look after one for you. Oh, there he is. There's the pussy. He doesn't want to talk to me. It's a lucky charm. Lucky the cat. All right. More cats. There's a turtle here. Can I open any of these? Oh. Wait, there it was. Come on. Step one, save money. Step two, save money. Skip three and four. Step five, save more money. Yeah, that's that's the way, kid. If only we were like that. Okay, that's party member two. Someone mentioned, <clears throat> I think this soldier? No, no that, that guy's on petrol, patrol duty. Duty. Oh yeah, this guy. Can I go talk with him? The Viper Manor here is destroyed several years prior. Mm -mm. 
Sir Norris has arrived. Please come in. In the basement, okay. Sir Norris is in the basement. Oh, there's Carl. Do I need her here? I believe it has been four years since I retired from the Dragoons. Ah, time sure does fly. I was shocked to hear of Darius' death three years ago. And now the General and the others are missing. The manor is in shambles. I took the liberty of conducting my own investigation, but I have discovered nothing. All I know is that a man named Lynx approached the General and has involved them in some kind of incident. The only difference with the other world you talk about is that something happened to the general three years ago here. I just hope that this Norris fellow knows something. <clears throat> I know nothing. I was not invo involved with the plan. I do not find it amusing. But she's still there, so we need her in the team. I'll go out and swap her in, just to see what happens. Or maybe she's just there because... I mean... Oh wait, she's gone now? She just says that for no reason? We sent some men to the El Nido Triangle to investigate a mysterious beam of light. And I hear there's a monster atop Sky Dragon Isle. What is up with this El Nido place? Well, that's a mystery you, you, you'd like to solve, wouldn't you? Can you even climb there? No. No. How did that guy climb over there? See? Oh, there he is. It is unstable here. Please enter through the well on your right to reach the basement. Okay. Can I, is there anything here? No. That's the well. Sir Norris is in the basement. Please enter through this well. Okay. I can do that as soon as I search around a bit. Wait, now it's gonna make sense, I think. Okay, that's where I go to the basement. What about here? Sir Norris is in the basement. Please enter through here. So, I, can I even go? It should bring me back to the forest, I think. Yeah. So it's this way. That's what I couldn't do in another world. Yep. Okay. A mithril helmet, you see. Hmm. Okay. Right, we did push it. 
Oh, it is going to create a bridge somewhere, I see. So I need two of those to make a bridge here. One of them must be over there. Yeah. Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> Anything behind this pillar? No. What about you, guy? The ladder leading to the prison is up ahead, sir. Oh, really? Can I push the barrel behind you? I kind of need it. Nope. Huh. So, that second barrel... I don't think I can get to it before this guy here moves. Or maybe not in this dimension at all. I'm not sure now. Never mind, I'll just leave for now. We'll remember this. Sir! Sir Norris is up this letter, sir! Hmm, it's all broken down. The whole mansion's like dilapidated. Locked. Well, yeah, I wanted to check. Qua! Mmm, those items. Smith Spirit, I want to see what it is. Wherever there's a customer, a blacksmith will be there. Just summon the Master Smith's spirit. Cool. Body much. Can I use the key? Matter key? Nope. Parlor key? I don't think. That guy had a key to the prison, right? You'll find Sir Norris in here. This seems to be the only accessible room. Okay. Sir Lynx, it has been a while, sir. As you can see, the manor is in shambles. There is still no sign of the general or the others. We are still investigating the area, but it appears that the frozen flame is not here. Sir, are you really Sir Lynx? You seem different than I remember. You are correct. This man is not Lynx. Excuse me, sir, but who might you be? I am Radius, a dragoon. Although I have been retired for four years. So you are Radius, one of the former four divas? It is an honor to meet you, sir. I believe you, sir, but it is still hard to accept that this man is not Sir Lynx. He may look like Lynx, but his spirit is that of another. That is quite strange, if I may say so. It is up to you what you want to believe. So what business did you have with Lynx? Have you uncovered anything about the disappearance of the general? You will not be... No. You will be doing us a great favor by telling us what you know. Very well. I will tell you what I know. What I just asked. That's lovely. I was actually Sir Lynx... It was actually Sir Lynx who approached us about the existence of the frozen flame in El Nido. Being from the main continent, we had doubted its very existence, so I was sent to the El Nido archipelago as a spy. I had narrowed down the location to Viper Manor, but it appeared as though General Viper and his men were in search of it as well. Eventually I was called back to Por, but it has 
It was then that I heard General Viper and his men had disappeared, and that the manor had been destroyed. I heard only recently that there is a good evidence that General and his men headed to the Dead Sea. The Dead Sea is an ocean located to the east. See, that's an ocean. Surrounded by coral. It used to be called the Sea of Eden, but even then, not many dared enter. We investigated the area, but to no avail. We could not find the end. We could find no entrance. <laughs> hey, mutation, good to see you, buddy. Oh, boy. <laughs> With this here now, huh? <laughs> Let's give it our best. <laughs> That's serious shit is going on. It is you, Sir Lings, who wish to change this distorted world using the frozen flame. <laughs> Turning into an opera. Ooh la la, such grand dreams, Monsieur Lings. Hold your tongue. Zut. So the dead she. <laughs> <laughs> that ocean was called the Sea of Eden until three years ago. <laughs> this may not be the clue we're looking for. <laughs> Once we uncover Lynx's plans, it should be easy enough to counter them. <laughs> Are you planning to the go to go to the Dead Sea? <laughs> <laughs> There is no way to get in there. We searched all over for an entrance, but to no avail. <laughs> no one knows anything about one either. Yes, I doubt you will be able to get in. I'm sure the demi-humans of Marble know something about this, but they did as humans, and I didn't prepare my verses. <laughs> Especially those from the main continent. <laughs> Up here. No, perhaps they sh would give us a hint if we were to go with you. <laughs> That's <laughs> That's more <laughs> That's more like he's fucking crying for his life and not singing. Oh god. Oh man <laughs> No thank you Joe. Thank you. <laughs> that is something <laughs> That is something new that we had there. Yep. <laughs> oh <laughs> Then, may I, may I join you, sir? I want to know, <laughs> I want to know if the frozen flame really exists and about everything that has happened here. What about you? Mm, moi? But of course, I will follow this Monsieur, Monsieur Lynx. The other one is no longer Monsieur Lynx. What do you mean? The surge? The real surge? <laughs> Hi, Joe. What's up, man? Monday morning-ish. Noon for you? Noon, yeah. Around noon. <laughs> there is a military boat docked in Termina. Let us use that. So Norris enlisted in your party. Soldier boy, what's your innate? Yellow. Okay, good. Because we have no one yellow in the new party. Black, yellow, red, green black green green we have three greens and two black but no yellow or white Norris what's your deal man high strength appears yeah he's stronger than Zappa even you know what I'll leave the party as is for now all right we got Norris That's member number three. So this whole session is about recruiting more party members. If it weren't wasn't obvious from the an announcement, we're back in terminal now. Oh, but we can go past the checkpoint, and we have a boat. All right, all right, okay. Still, um, there's another party member to collect, <laughs> to recruit in this part of the world. In this part of this world. You there, stop! 
I'm on lookout duty, watching for suspicious ships. Don't bother me. Okay, man. I mean, the only one ship can fit in this dock. But sure. Whatever works for you. Is this... Wait, we're, we're gonna use the tiny ship, right? Definitely, they're not gonna give us an actual boat, are they? We're gonna use the raft ship. Only military personnel are allowed on this boat. Wait, we have... Two of us are military, at least. I don't know about Zappa. But he's a blacksmith. He counts as military. Never mind, we'll come back. Let's leave Terminal for now. <laughs> and, uh... <laughs> Let's go recruit Fungi. I still think I'm missing something here. So let me pass. This area is currently under investigation. We still do not know what caused the manor to collapse. So, like three years later, you're checking it out, huh? We are still investigating, but we have yet to find any clues to the whereabouts of General Viper and his men. Dude, if the mansion fell on their heads, like if it just collapsed on their heads, you wouldn't find damn pudding by now, like three years later. <laughs> I get it, it's for the purposes of the game story, but still. <laughs> A little late to the party. Is there anything down here? I'm just gonna... Oh! Okay. The enemies are back. Attack! Oh, it's the gloops. Let's just go feral cats immediately. <laughs> Imagine that. <laughs> Gloop. <laughs> oh, it's dead. Just a smack from Master Roshi here. I didn't even get to try Zappa. Wait, what about that kid? Oh, should I have talked to the kid first? What's their innate? Do I have something red that hurts both of them? Magma Burst. That's just for one. And all these Magma Bomb is for both. Oh fuck it. Do that. Zappa's red, right? Let's see what he does. Oh, nice accuracy right at the start. He's dead, Jim. And then you can do a magma. Oh, hammer throw. Spin like a top to knock foes lying. Yeah, I could use that. Or hammer blow. Single item. Beat the earth to rattle your foe. Yep. Let's do a hammer blow. Zappa smash. Shoo hoo hoo. Sheesh. Okay. That's the way to go. Oh god damn it. I did not want to fight fight that thing. Meteor shower should be everybody, yep. Oh beautiful.
Radius defense, huh? They're blue, so Zappa again, your turn. Okay, we'll try the the double hammers now, whatever it's called. I'm really curious. Ah, I don't have enough. Do I have enough now? Yes, hammer throw, old enemies. That's probably just gonna obliterate them. <laughs> yep. Very heavy, heavy damage. Okay. So Zappa's pretty useful, aside from, you know, giving you the ability to use the smithy anywhere on the on the world map or at the save point they're all blue okay let's let's just zap them to that <laughs> Yep, there you go. Hammer time! Phew! He does not play around. Let's let's do some radius damage. Anything for everyone, single enemy, single enemy, magma bomb will get everyone. Oh, I just need to finish them off, come on. Should have a magma bomb by now. Yep, that should be it, come on. You already have two reds on the field, so yeah. Boosts the damage. said he saw a great item and went inside the, this cave but then a big huge rock fell down and now pass trapped papa wait really one budge can i can i do something about it what's the time shifter oh yeah okay Hmm, anything that could destroy the boulder? Rum a pouch, that's not gonna help. Big egg, ice breath, Biba flute, green tinkler? No. I don't know what to do about the rock. Can I. Can anybody do, do anything? Oops. Nope. Uh, no, not that. There. I don't know, I was hoping that maybe he can do it. I don't know what these are. I guess... No battles and whatnot. Ah! So, how do we help him? Huh, I don't know what to do about that rock. I don't think there's anything here that can help him. 
うんレッツリメンバーダッドフォーレーダーアズウェルあーなおいごスローリーアップストリームあ、ah, he should be, he should have moved now, so、sure、that's the thing. Damn it. <laughs> Wrong platform. There we go. Wonder why it has the fiery theme. Where does this go? What does that do? Obviously, changes the, the level of the water, I think. I don't remember this, so I don't think I did this on my first, my previous run. Is there more water now? I wonder what what does that do? Let's check it out once more. Alphabet. <laughs> I guess they're too weak for me. I don't have Luminaire anymore, though. That sucks. We're just getting some good skills. Meteor Shower should take care of them, though. Proton beam power! La 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 la! Yeah! The nut Kamehameha. Zap was like, huh? Bunch of iron. The other world. Which world doesn't have iron? I think. So, what does this do? I really. Maybe it changes something in the. So now water runs fast. Oh, I see. It's for this part. Passing through. The water doesn't run fast, so you can cross. But how to get there? That's the question. I think I gotta climb the ladder I used previously. Why is this here? This part here, like, oh, probably where I would end up if the current was strong or something, I don't know.
The area beyond seems to be completely blocked off. Okay, how about the doors though? Damn, so close yet so far. And it's not the uh, manor key. Maybe I gotta find it in the other world? The dungeon key? There's Norris. How go the battle preparations? Do you have room for me, sir? Not now, Norris. I don't believe there is much else here. This looks like a torturing dungeon. Like a torture house. What is this room? You've never seen a dungeon before? Torture chamber? But there's nothing else here. I wonder, how do I get to the rest of that dungeon-y thing? Let's check if it resets by itself. I can go around them pretty easily. Okay, so it stays closed. I just gotta find a way to get there. Somehow. What what even is it? Where where is it? I'm confused, but good thing. It's something new. Is it the part of the mansion or is it in the bluffs? Watch out for the gloop! They're white. Uh, white in eight, I think. Just a slap. Two cure pluses. Woohoo! Fuck that bug. I'm really curious about that boulder though. Maybe that has something to do with this. I'm just gonna peek down. Down there and see if I can maybe move it now. Does it change the speed of this water? Won't budge. Carnivore trap, okay. Do any of these guys use it? Carnivore, I, I mean. Oh, look, the, the forest is a bit different. Oh, damn it. I, I was hoping we were just gonna slide past each other.
It's just gonna fry him. The opposing color, just no way it survives. Oh, or yes way, I guess. Uh, I stand corrected. Does that mean it's weaker? Yeah. Look at its posture, so to say. Electro ball to you too, Sir Balbi. Smack. Just left the seed. I don't know if I should be disgusted or or happy about that. So another chest there. I'm gonna start from the beginning. Why though? I can just cross. <clears throat> On guard, flowery fellows. All the yellow magic, all the yellow elements are connected to earth and electricity. So that's what we're gonna see a lot of as long as we're fighting these green guys. Zappa doesn't need magic. He just hammers him to death. There's one over there, but... I thought I saw another chest. That's probably the one I was looking at. Wait, there should be something here. What's bubbling the, up there? Maybe I should push something in there? Nothing there. What is that? Oh, that's the way. It looks like an alien fox thing. Couscous. Well, I know couscous is like food, but it's also spelled different. Which element? Green. So yellows again, huh? We got nothing yellow that hits all enemies, unfortunately. Let's swing Zappa now instead of Radius. Just want to see what it's going to be like. He must have something yellow. Bolt plus one, and bolt, okay. A capsule. Well, I expected something better but we'll see another couscous throw oh, straight in my face i 
as if it was waiting here for me. Hey zombie! How's work treating you today? Damn, Radius is blind. Zappa's just gonna finish him off. Another piece of mithril. I'm missing something here. I should have some kind of a mushroom. Or maybe it's in this screen? The thing's still there. Let's try again from this side. Maybe I need to use my aroma pouch? Where did I see those? I think it was in this screen? Yeah, those little like flowery things. That's it. Nope. There's another one here. All three are the same color this time. Damn it, it was the... <laughs> I thought the blob attacked me. Okay, this should be easy. Love, can I get a glass of water, please? Thank you. Thank you so much. Yeah, the ladder. Thanks. Okay, now maybe a aroma pouch. Okay, I must be missing something. I didn't think it had to do with the something with that boulder. Let's kill this guy as well, and then I'll check. Just to make sure I'm not messing it up. A close up of Zappa's ass. For some reason. Hey, what's with the spinning dude? We'll kill everything first. Give it the aroma pouch. 
Let me check that out. I know I've seen somewhere. IGN should tell us. There we go. Okay, speak to the kid. Okay, it is. It does have something to do with that boulder. Huh. I gotta go back into the cave. Because I need a mushroom. To get my next playable character into the party. I'm not gonna tell you much. I'm just gonna say... I don't want to spoil it, I'm just going to say he's a fun guy. <laughs> oh, it's raining here. Two couscous. There, in the forest, everything, like all these enemies, the whole two kinds of enemies we're encountering are green aligned, so we're still defaulting on electricity and earth. Thanks, love. Oi, love. Ah, thanks, I was really thirsty. Okay, so try to not touch anything here. Oh, God damn it! Okay. Maybe I can just escape and run past them. I'll try. What now? The same guy? Seems you can't go around it, so... Who's got the red? Zappa? annoying when there's a lot of enemies because they keep attacking and interrupting but should be enough if I do this now I should have enough yeah I have six levels of elemental power so I can do a hammer throw hammer time God damn it, every hit.
Okay. That should finish them all. Multi kill. Did I see nimble? I thought I saw something called nimble. It's probably something else. I have nine cure pluses too, all of a sudden. You can have a cure plus instead. What's up with that bug? Huh? Okay. There we go. Wait, in the middle of... <laughs> I just got attacked just before the dialogue. It is buggy. The Graviton is all enemies, right? Yeah. That's a cricket, is it? I got nothing for multiple enemies. He's totally Master Roshi. <laughs> I made it inside okay, but I couldn't find the exit. Thanks for your help. Please accept this as a token of my appreciation. I found it inside this cave. Got a mushroom. That mushroom is a delicacy and can only be found in Guardia. I wonder if it's real. If what's real? Guardia, Chrono's homeland. Uh, wait, I should be able to pop. Yep, there we go. Ooh, a mushroom. <laughs> Pause back! <laughs> My voice is giving out. I can't go higher than that. <laughs> uh, let's check the... Let's check the items. There's the mushroom here. Yes, it is. An expensive delicacy found only in the Guardia region. It's sort of like truffles without the chocolate. <laughs> Sorry about that, Mario. <laughs>
I have to take that to the cave. The cave was here, I think. Yep. Don't even dare. Oh, who's that? Hey, let me see that mushroom. Whoa, this is a rare mushroom found only in Guardia. Or so it seems. Anyway, what do you say we make a deal? Your mushroom for my treasure. Sure. This better be good. Oh, this rich fragrance. Blah, 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 blah. Mmm, the way it melts in your mouth, yet how the firm texture brings out the flavor. De de blah. Delicious! Man, that was good! What? Do I have something on my face? Huh? <laughs> ah! 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 Chew! Huh? Oh, he's becoming a green zombie. What the? No! A mushroom monster! How could you do this to me? It's all your fault! Look at his eyes. <laughs> his name is Fungi. Sorry. I know. Why don't you join us? <laughs> the frozen flame should be able to change you back to normal. Fine. That's exactly what I'll do. I'll stalk you through the depths of hell. Ah, uh, choo! He's little Baku from Final Fantasy IX. Fun guy, join your party. Yellow, okay. Good strength. And not so bad magic. Really good. Well, everything else is so-so. Still want your treasure. Force charm, nice. Because you look like a mushroom. <laughs> when guy eats a mushroom, he becomes fun guy. <laughs> He seems depressed, really. What did I want to check? Uh, yeah, the charm. We got the. I think that's the last charm. Do we have six of them now? Forest charm. Protection against anti green. So, forest, demon, angel, earth, sea, and flame. That's six. So, we got all six charms, which is good. Now, we could come across an enemy that uses anti-fields, we can put the charms on and be done with it. Well, make it easier, it's not just gonna solve itself, but you know what I mean. Okay, that's, that's it for fungi. No, you first. I insist. <laughs> Why, remember Terran from uh, Zelda Link's Awakening? He turns into a raccoon after he eats a mushroom. And he gets the power to teleport you around the map somehow. Oh, I can do it, come on. Yeah. Okay. Okay, now, now we should head and use uh, the boat. I'm pretty sure. We got, what, four new playable characters, right? Let's go through Termina. Why does the music of Termina not change, though? Alright, we got a motorboat, 
Really? Zelbus, okay. But I don't want to board Zelbus yet. Pyre Shore, that's where I want to be. Mislim da mislim ono kod beer festa. Hot doggity damn. We're gonna beat the shit out of that dog. I'm not using magic because we're gonna auto heal after the battle. Oh, he's using bite. Oh, not my pee pee. So, I'm gonna message you, Toga. Zato su premestili Beerfest 2007. 8. Kad je onaj klinac upao u... Klinac, ha. Lik šta je bio, upao u kavez u zaoškom vrtu. Pa je od tad Beerfest kod Ušića. Oh, I got a red wolf trap. Nice. Da. Oh shit, what's up with the bull? What's up with Zappa? He just got stuck there. Terminator. <laughs> red, red, huh? So we need the blues. Heavy damage, man. What's the bluest blue you have? Not much blue here, so let's go with the feral cats. Alright, something blue high level, eye bla ice blast, yeah. So long, pussy. Warrior pussy. Frozen, nice. We can just finish him now. What's the bluest blue you have, Zappa? Ice Blast plus two. 
Sure. Immediately. Good. Is it done? Yeah. We got three blues, but... Uh, Cure plus, not gonna work. Ice lands. Fuck it, we'll just freeze the bull. Nah, I'm missing the missile on a, on a Torminator. A <laughs> Torminator. What's up with our stamina, though? I'm gonna defend. Everybody defends. Ooh, he's got an Inferno. You know, this would be a great time to lay an Inferno trap if I knew he had that. got burns why didn't I see that that's why his stamina was so slow that's not even him never mind elements use ointment there's another one okay now I can trap an inferno this time I'm gonna be ready allocate Level 5. <laughs> no, who did I put that on? Zappa. Someone's going to get a whoop-ass radius. So now we wait for him to use it. Hedgehog Lion. <laughs> Does have spiky hair. No, not the only guy who's... Uh, what, what was I looking at? Never mind. We're waiting for an Inferno.
Everybody defend. There we go. Got it. Ha <laughs> ha. Okay, who's got the strongest blue magic now? Ice Blast. Blech. And an Aqua Ball should be enough. Look, he's still not dead. Damn, then I really gotta beat him up. There we go. <laughs> I'm just I'm just recharging for the next wave, Luca. Alright, we trapped an inferno. Fuck you, Duggity. Hot Duggity no less. Okay, so not the right one, again. <laughs> Scary shit, is it? <laughs> Alright, use... That's why I bought so many capsules. Did I get Inferno now as a spell? I should, yeah. Yep. Heats air to a burning hot temperature for all enemies. It was worth it. Using a trap for that. There we go. Oh, they're bunching up. But I see no chests, so... I guess I can use the Ice Breath. We're down to 1 HP again, huh? I could charge on the doggity. Like heal. Using them to beef up the elements. And we got a pussy here. Who's got the bluest of the blue? Radius, I think? Should really bring someone blue into a fiery hot volcano. We don't have anyone blue at the moment, do we? Did she get the dinner? Oh, okay. Then she just wants attention. Lynx is almost dead. Well then, I guess. This is what we gotta do. Let's do some feral cats. Pussy attack, go! Multipus attack.
Holy shit, that's a strong cat. Should be done after this. What you got that can hit everyone, old man? Nothing, but I can ice lance the cat burger. Hot doggity. <laughs> Look at <her. laughs> Hammer time. Oh no, that's just single, damn it. Damn it! A cockbite. They should have just called it cockbite. Another one. <laughs> oh, I need to rest my PP. That's with the block. Whew. Will you please die? You know what? I think I'm just gonna... Oh, meet your shower. There we go. You got three reds, I should correct that with anything. <laughs> it's not Final Fantasy VII Supernova, but it's almost as epic. Okay, doggity, it's time to Time to dog out of here, but how? You know what? Quick draw. I love how Radius has bigger eyebrows than, you know, he, his eyebrows are so big you can't see his eyes at all. And another one. Damn, I'm gonna escape this battle. I got nothing to do here. Can't even steal at this point. Oh, they ambushed us. It looks like it's trying to sell me broken stereos or something. The way it's hunched back, it's almost as if it's gonna open up its coat and be like, Psst, hey kid, want some cat food? Alright, there's too many Taurus here. Torminators. Whew. There's another fiery pit, but do I wanna... Yes. I mean, I came this far. Of course I wanna. There's one. There we go. I knew there was something there. And we won HP into battle. Like a pro. Oh, no, we're fucked. We gotta heal like... Oh, wait. Lynx is okay for some reason?
heal all, like right away. Recover all. Okay, now we just gotta freeze the hot guy. Lava rush. Someone's gonna have a headache. Zappa, Zappa can take it, I think. Plus he's red, isn't he? Close, but he lives. Yes, okay, now we got some time. Fuck it, I'm not even gonna heal. Go, Zappa, everything's on you. I think I'm gonna finish him in this turn. Sheesh, okay, uh, glide hook. <laughs> yeah. Please die! I, I'm banking on you dying here, sir. Alright. Damn. Gotta be close to it, yeah. Dinador, Dinodorite, the that thing. Bye. Oh, you can go down here? How? How do I do that? I wonder, do I have to beat this guy up? I bet John would know. Was there anything here? I can't remember what... Yeah, this is where I'm gonna do the... Where I'm finally gonna be able to hatch the egg, that's right. Because this is... We went again to another world for Dragonia. We're in home world now. Do I want to swap party members? First, Smith Spirit. Ooh, we can get a better weapon? Fuck yeah, yes I want it. Silver. Argent gun for him. Could even uh, get him into the party. Silver axe. For fungi,
Good, we have mithril goods now. We can't make anything else for now. Let's equip. Oh wait, he's got mithril swallow, silver swallow. 45, okay, silver staff, nothing better, but... So he should have a mithril vest instead. Still, still better than he has, only has higher evasion. Here... Mithril helmet. Norris had a better weapon. Ferris gun. Fun guy had a better weapon. there, it was here. Bone axe, I don't need the bone axe anymore. Bone sword, bone letter. I should sell these things rather than So I can turn my stuff back into components here, but I can also sell them for money. Oh, that's a whole thing. Some of them are really expensive, 1600 for that. What about this assemble? Yeah, you get stuff from this. <clears throat> so that means I can still turn some of this stuff. Ooh, imagine, imagine disassembling a charm or selling it. Shiny Amber. Shiny Dew, huh? Okay, we can um, swap party members. Do we want to do that now? Who would I take with me? No, not Smith Spirit. Sorry, wrong thing. Uh, teleporter. I mean, I'm not crazy. For now, maybe a radius? I want to swap him out for Norris. There. And now we go do this. Radius. Yes. Uh, same for elements. Yes. And then allocate everything back on Norris. Oh really, I don't have any more mithril helms? Oh, there, there we go. Yeah, I knew I should have one. Mm. 
Why not dancing shoes? If I find something better, I'll use it. Maybe if the tech power. Nah, that'll be okay. There you go. No elements. Look, his grid is also awesome. What are his techs? Spiral ray shoots a twisting ray of aura from your pistol. And sun shower. Fire aura in the air to cause a rain of bullets. That's pretty cool. There we go, one of each color, exactly six. Sorry sis, I missed that, I'm not what? Cure plus, definitely. Capsule, yes. You never know when you're gonna need them as we've seen. Graviton. Actually, better photo beam, huh? Oh. <laughs> Nothing's been proven yet. Magma burst. Nice blast. Got that inferno. <laughs> I'm not crazy. Ah! <laughs> Nothing else, level 5. Let's put a uh, low res. And finally, for 6. Nobody blue yet, I need someone with blue alignment, but nobody in the new party. Magnify, sure. There we go, Norris, you're kind of equipped, man. We'll see what you can do. Alright, that's it for today. Let's stop here. It's been a nice session. We have two more party members to uh, recruit. The two most interesting ones. <clears throat> so next time we're doing this is on Wednesday, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, Wednesday. Tomorrow we'll see if I can play uh, Outbreak Online. Then with Mammon and Zombie we'll do a File 2 run. If not, Elimination run. If not, then I'll just continue the PAL version from the other day. We have two more scenarios left, so I think Desperate Times and End of the Road with Bots is going to amount to around three hours anyway, so that's it. That's all for today, everyone. Stay well, and I'll see you next time. See you, sis. Am I what? I mean, I could, I could check if someone's online. I'll see if someone's you. online, then I'll raid. <laughs> Bye! Bye-bye <laughs> for now.